guys, Katrina Kazel Vlogs here from Van Life Philippines. So today I'm gonna do the most awaited van tour. <laughs> my tiny van this is a Suzuki DA62 I got this from um, I got this newly assembled in Cebu through Bigfoot truck surplus all right so let's get inside it's a tiny camper which fits me and my two kids so it's the three of us here in my van we don't live in the van yet. Uh, we don't live full time, but we travel on weekends. We use this as our um, as our bed and kitchen, and <laughs> this is our hotel on weekends. Let's get in that. So as you can see, I'm here in the front seat. This isn't a reversible seat, guys, because. Um, uh, this is so tiny a reversible seat uh, would be possible here I just manually slide in and slide out this uh, passenger seat over here so I can have a bigger space uh, over here all right so let's get to the fun part if you're watching my channel I love 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 super love coffee of course and I love wine at the same time so this is my coffee and wine bar um, I have no wine at the moment but I have this um, wine glasses very cute wine <laughs> wine glasses and I have some drip coffee I have my um, what's this coffee grinder my mocha pot some coffee beans uh, coffee and also I have here my coffee strainer and some uh, drip coffee okay so let's talk about my sink uh, this is a super um if you can if others would say it's too big for my van but no um i picked I specifically picked this size because it's the size of my toilet down below if you can see there is my toilet down below there my toilet down below and that's my clean water I'll discuss that later on uh, for now okay so I, I specifically choose a bigger sink let's move all the stuff here all right so as you can see I specifically chose a bigger sink because um, you know when my kids uh, sometimes it's my kids is doing the dishes and I don't want them to splatter all over the floor or splatter um, water on the floor or on the wood uh, materials so I specifically picked this one that it has this um, uh, what do you call this one metal part over here I don't know what it's called but it's super handy there it's pretty big so um, this is also multi-purpose because if we if we travel um, those stuff that fly off you know when I drive I put it here on this side so like the like my plants I put them here when I'm driving uh, to secure them and so they don't so soil won't be all over the place here and I also have uh, this is very handy I have the basin over there and this um, uh, this uh, what do you call this one cutting board fits perfectly over here so I can use this as an extra table this is a there also an extra also an extra table if uh, I'm going to cook be cooking inside because um, well the Philippines has two seasons we have the rainy and the sunny season so um, it's not always sunny when we go camping there are times that it's really raining and an indoor kitchen would be very handy of course I have my fire extinguisher guys don't worry this is actually a sliding window this is a sliding door so I just open it when I'm cooking there um, let's, we're gonna close that right now I can do I can cook here 
so uh, as uh, this is my favorite um mm, kettle I, I only have one well i put it here because i tend to um heat up water most of the time so i i want it uh to in here where i can always see them over here i have here a a cute drawer sticks um spoons and forks some bowls this is where i put my placemat so if we want to eat i just put it like that over there there so i put the food here and the grilling pan is usually here because uh we love to grill you know it's it's, it's i guess faster <laughs> i don't know oh we always grill when we camp so let's talk about sink I and mean, someone gave me this to use it on a uh, mango fertilizer um i clean it and that's my water pump right there so it's just like that um you pump it so you pump it pump it like that and the water is gonna drain um i'm supposed to use it over my faucet over here but i can't find the right fitting yet um uh, my sink is a work in progress i know <laughs> it's a work in progress and also my um my gray water tank it's a pretty small one right now um again it's a work in progress i'm still working on that uh, i wanted to have um a it's a very portable very cute actually the gray water tank my gray water tank is very cute and it comes to this so it just drains Alright, so let's get put them back. Put everything back for a very tidy kitchen. Okay. It's my go-to meal, oatmeal. Pero hindi naging slim, yaks. Hindi pa rin naging slim. Hindi pa rin naging slim sa 2021. Alright, so now let's talk about um, um, our bed. Our bed setup. Okay, so if... Um, as you can see uh, this is at night time so at night time I just uh, pull this out oh, these are the these are my handmade lights that I made uh, these are the fair lights that I tied up because uh, they tend to mess around um, last time one of my fair lights got stuck in the be in the beeping something and my van beep uh, I don't know how to, how to call it. It was beeping all the time. It was so annoying. That's why I have to keep my place tidy. So this is my um, this is where I store my um, gadgets, accessories, right there. So this is where I store my um, camera accessories, my tripods, um, uh, GoPro accessories, and I also have here. Uh, my lap chap and important stuff because I don't want them to um, to break or yeah but the, the floor is heavily insulated so I don't I don't think it's gonna uh, it's gonna damage my uh, laptop plus I don't leave it um, when it's too hot the van is in is exposed in a very hot environment I don't leave it so this over here is my um, some of my clothes and uh, pillows uh, no no not pillows blankets so if I wanted to sleep, if we wanted to sleep, we just pull this out here. Uh, there's another one over here. So I can stretch out. Um, actually, the three of us can fit in here now pretty nicely. <laughs> over here is my outdoor kitchen. Of course, when it's sunny, we want to cook outside. Uh, so it will be very tidy when we go inside. Kids can rest outside and then I can cook my meals here. This is, um, this is where I store my pantry. Um, here and some supplies. Uh, so this is Tawa. Show them. Uh, this is my pantry. At the moment it's not full. I don't also feed my kids. Um, I don't I don't usually feed my kids like um, canned goods, no, or uh, noodles. Uh, uh, just sometimes but not really so I don't have canned goods here um, I always cook or buy 
um, on the road, uh, fish or pork. And this is also where I store my um, my other um, this is my extra plates uh, for my guests if I have guests. So if I want to cook, I can use this area here. And uh, this is the best part. Um, I I all I really love this one. This part here. Because over here I can make my coffee. Uh, this is where, by the way, I store my pots and pans, the butane um, tanks. Uh, no, not the butane, that LPG uh, canisters. I use LPG canister, right, uh, uh, guys? Uh, this one. This one. LPG canister. Uh, this is safer and refillable. Unlike the butane, so butane canisters, they're not refillable. So if I wanted to cook, cook something, I can cook here. Yeah. And you can use that as a table, an extra table. So my butane stove. Um bear with me guys, it's not really clean. I just use it. So there, my butane stove. I can focus ka ayo kay delicia I'm sorry guys. Alright, so if I wanted to cook here, I can cook here and prepare meals here. Um, um, chop something over here. And I also have a, a sink, a foldable sink. So I can just um, probably add some water tank and wash some dishes out, outside. Very organized, right? Over here, by the way, is my overhead compartment. I have or storage. Uh, you know, as you can see, it's very messy at the moment. There's my tents, um, tripods. I have some yoga mats and um, some pump. What do you call this one? For my bike. Um, pretty much uh, the light, only light, uh, very light materials. So we're, uh, very light stuff here. Um, also my what do you call a snorkeling mask something some gears oh, this is the storage for my gears let's talk about um, the conversion itself well basically I I just spent around 15,000 yeah it's not much right I know I'm so happy um, I was able to maximize my money <laughs> my 15k over uh, some important stuff i get to have a bigger sink and i get to have this wall cladding over here uh, this is the um no hindi pa siya natarong hindi siya talaga naayos because i had this done by um he's not a professional you know um this is some pretty wall cladding uh that i really love uh these are just engineered wood so uh it's not so expensive like an eight feet of this is only cost only 144 pesos so it's not really expensive and for this one my ceiling this is um my uh, after initially um i actually removed the i removed the carpet it was previously a carpet over here remove the carpet and i take ha out half of the I mean, what do you call that remaining, I mean, that part after the carpet. I don't know what it's called, but it, it has a form already on it. So, I just decided to take it out and paste my banig over there. So, now, as you can see, my banig isn't lilai anymore. Uh, before, it was really lilai. I don't know how to how to put it over the ceiling. And it's very special because um, my Lola had made this one. So, yeah. It's, I wanted to buy a one, a new one. It's pretty old actually, but um, it always reminds me of my Lola, which I really love. Uh, that's 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 where I got my brown color. I lined up some, what do you call this one? Abaca. I decided to just line up some abaca rope over here. I line up some abaca rope over here. And then, there, there. And if you can see on this part right here, um, it's not really nicely done, but uh, it's it looks pretty nice uh, because this was so dirty. I discovered it with a summer um, cloth, summer look vibe cloth. Also, I put it on that part here, there, if you can see. 
I cover that part with uh, this type of cloth. It's really nice. And of course, I love my uh, what's this? Um, curtains. Curtains. Um, my friend Ruby made this one. Shout out, Ruby! Thank you so much. Uh, she made this one. Uh, it's so nice. I like it. It's it's so airy. It makes the place really airy. Uh, I, I added um, insulation, a pretty much heavy insulation on the and the flooring, and then I added some plywood, and then I I used some vinyl, um, some stick on um, vinyl over here. It's it looks really nice. Okay. And of course here, over here is my power station. Oh. I use this for my lights there and of course for my Wi-Fi if I wanted to connect to Wi-Fi at least this is handy but anyway, thank you so much ProMate Philippines this has been with me for more than a year now and I'm, I'm so satisfied with the product I would suggest you get this guys but um, uh, for my laptop I don't charge my laptop on it <laughs> my laptop takes so much battery so it drains I mean not really drains but I don't know it's gonna take so much of my battery in the power station so I don't use it's using up so much batteries on my power station so I don't I don't use it on my laptop all right I charge my laptop when we travel so we can watch Netflix on the road uh, I mean when we're sleeping we sleep or rest at night um, but it's really handy um, I use it for my fans and this could last for me for about a week because uh, before I sleep, I, I sleep before work and I use my fan over it. Um, it's pretty handy. This is my small fan. Also dependable, very dependable. So you need top lang siya. <laughs> okay, and of course for my Wi-Fi, I use PLDT. So how do we shower nga ba guys? Uh, this has been with me for almost a year na. Uh, yeah. Uh, this is very dependable. This can last up to three, uh, three, um, what do you call this one? Three camping trips. And it's the three of us is gonna uh, use it. Just using it. So I just uh, add, I just put it in a water tank or water gallon and then shower. It's a pretty nice shower. And I also have my um, toilet pen. Uh, which you can see in my previous video. I guess that's just about it for now. I guess that's just about it for now guys. Um, I added some lights. Um, I want to play with my lights. I'll show you the lights. Uh, I added some lights over here. There. And also over here. Um, these are battery operated. These are... Um, I can operate this by a remote. Let's turn it off. I'll show it to you. Mm -hmm. I'll show you a video of how it go, how it works, how I had this done um, nighttime. So, I mean at night. So it's just about it, guys. Thank you so much for staying. If you've been, uh, if you're still here up to this point, thank you so much. Um, thank you so much for your support, guys. I owe it to you a lot. I was inspired I was inspired to do this um, uh, because of you guys of course uh, and I wanted to have a uh, comfortable uh, even though this is just a tiny van I want my kids to be comfortable with it like I want this cozy homey feel to it so I guess that's it guys thank you thank you thank you love you love you thank you for the support love you bye Make sure, to, make sure to subscribe, like, and share. <laughs> Alright, so my videographer, by the way, it's my queenie. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And the side is over here. Over here.